Good evening, folks. It's Diamond with the Oppenheimer Ranch Project, Magnetic Reversal News, and Shinrin Yoku. And you're looking at a plasma filament headed our way. In fact, it just blasted off center disk about 12, 14 hours ago, and it is headed our way in about 18 hours. It'll be here, let's say, February 9th. Just a glancing blow, according to the models. But we're going to walk you through some of the space weather in just a few minutes including the fact that we are currently at in an electron storm here. We've come up above the SWPC alert threshold, and we've been there, well, for quite some time, for days now. So we are currently in electron storm, low level, albeit. But the plasma filament in question is spectacular, and we're going to show it to you again and again and again. So first, we're going to look at it in 304 angstroms here. And wait for this is the region where the filament gets ejected from. And we have a coronal hole coming in. It's amazing. Now, right here is the, there it is. There's that plasma filament. And you can see how it came right towards the screen that it's coming right towards Earth. Right there. So let's go back and show it again. That's the filament. And now take a look. The filament replaces itself immediately thereafter. Absolutely fascinating. So there's the filament replacing the old one. It just blasted off. Here's the first filament. It destabilizes. Boom, it's gone. Watch this. It replaces itself immediately. That, the sun is amazing. Now we're going to look at it uh, in 193 angstroms here. I'm going to have to run this through to the beginning. Here it is. So keep a close eye on the central disk at the spot. And you can see the filament there lifting up. Boom. A little less visual um, in 193 angstroms than the 304. But the 304 is just completely spectacular. There's a little glitch before it right there. And then, boom, it lifts off. And then it gets replaced immediately. Now, what does that mean for you and I? Well, it means that there's plasma coming towards Earth at very high speed. And it could perturb our geomagnetic facilities. And the telemetry could bring us into geomagnetic storm. And so over at the Space Weather Prediction Center here, the planetary K index is showing uh, KP at two, um, but this plasma density could be able to push this up towards five. We've, we haven't fallen uh, that far down in plasma density. And we can co come over here to discover solar wind and see that the BZ angle is uh, calming down the triangle has now shifted Earth to Sun, and we'll be waiting for that to shift back Sun to Earth, where this blue line jumps back down here. Uh, the density is dropping off quite low. The speed, though, is still above 450 and is coming up a little. So if we are still in uh, plasma speed around 400, 450, this could jump up to 600 uh, with this uh, filament. And then that could bring us potentially to KP6 or so. So we're going to keep a close eye on that and see how this filament eruption affects you and I as it is headed towards Earth, as we are in electron storm. And according to both of the plasma wind models, the Enlil Spiral and ISWA, there is a filament and it's headed our way. There she comes. And then it'll be a boom to knowledge. Proper prior planning prevents piss poor performance as we... Keep you up to date to space weather and anything you may have to worry about. Now, this is going to be a low-level event. This is not anything like a kill shot or anything, so don't get your panties in a bunch. But this is you and I learning together how to predict your own space weather using the links below. Now, these videos are coming from Soho, and the other information is coming from multiple sources. But we'll leave you links to the Enlil Spiral, to ISWA, and all of the solar prediction material that we shared with you tonight as a plasma filament is coming to strike us. Now, they're claiming it's the 10th, but I think it's going to come here uh, probably in the next 18 hours. And so we'll just have to see who was right there. So take heed when the clock says Wednesday, February 9th, check our channel for an update. That's a boom. We love each and every one of you. Thanks to our one-time donors, our Patreons, everyone that shares this video. You're all heroes. That's a boom. Mm -hmm.